Good day. In this video, I will teach you the step-by-step -step coding of spherical manipulator in robotics toolbox by Peter Cork for MATLAB Online. So, I have already created a script named spherical underscore sim dot f. Okay, so let's just uh, display the title so this is spherical manipulator link length is yes. okay. so our link length will be based from our from our kinematic diagram okay so we have here three link lengths so a1 okay so let's make a sub 1 7 meters okay a2 is equals to 3 meters then a3 is equals to 2 meters then for our joint variable, we have a prismatic joint in our spherical manipulator. So the joint variable, prismatic joint, the joint variable of our prismatic joint is D3. Okay, so I forgot to create a, to create individual variables. So seems A sub 1, A sub 2, A sub 3, and D sub 3. If you notice, there are red symbols, okay, at the right side of MATLAB. If there are red symbols, if there, it means there is something wrong, okay. So now we have a uh, Sims D3. Let's put some uh, value. I will put at uh, three. Okay, so this is three meters. The limit will be zero to three meters. Okay. So now the red. Uh, red uh, colors are gone. Okay, so let's proceed to the dish parameters. Okay, so from H01 is equals to link, so open parenthesis, square parenthesis, semicolon, okay, uh, link, sorry, link. So, this is a revolute joint. So, this will be 0. Next is D. So, this is A sub 1. Next is R. So, this is 0. Next is alpha. So, alpha is 90 degrees. So, this will be pi over 2. This is revolute. So, offset is 0. Then, next offset is 0. A. So, H0 underscore 1 dot Q L I M is equals to square parenthesis. So this is the base joint. So our common uh, limit at the base joint is a uh, negative pi over two to pi over two. So this is ni negative ninety degrees to ninety degrees. Okay. Next H one underscore is equals to okay link close open parenthesis then square parenthesis I forget the semicolon okay so we have 90 degrees at the uh, second link we have 90 degrees plus theta so, based on the rule, if revolute joint, theta is equals to 0. So, let's make this 0. Then, D is equals to nothing. So, this is still 0. R is equals to 0. Alpha is equals to 90 degrees. So, pi divided by 2. Then, uh, offset is equals to 0. Then, after offset, we have here, a rule that after offset put the value of theta. The value of theta is 90 degrees. 
Okay, so we will put here pi over 2. Okay, then enter, then h0, sorry, h1 underscore 2 dot q limit is equals to square parenthesis semicolon. Okay, so our second joint is again this. Okay. Just like uh, the second joint of articulated manipulator, so what we will do is instead of a uh, negative pi over 2, let's make it negative pi over 6 or negative 30 degrees, then pi over 2, positive 90 degrees. Okay, for our third link, okay, so the third link is a prismatic joint. Or within the third link is the prismatic joint. Score 3 is equals to link. Close open parenthesis, square parenthesis, semicolon. Okay. So, theta is 0, d is 0, d is 0. Okay. Oh, sorry. We have a2 plus a3 as uh, D but uh, this is prismatic joint so D is equals to 0 R is equals to 0 alpha is equals to 0 offset is equals to 1 because prismatic joint then the value of D the value of D is A2 plus A3 okay. then the limit, so h2 underscore 3 dot q limit is equals to square parenthesis uh, from 0. So this is a prismatic joint. So the limit is from 0 up to positive d3. Okay? The joint variable d is always positive. Now let's compile. Let's name this compilation. Uh, Spe. SPHE is equals to serial link. Okay. Let's open parenthesis. Sorry, don't put semicolon. Okay, square parenthesis. So, H0. Sorry, horn. What's that? H0. Underscore 1 h1 underscore 2 then h2 underscore 3 then name okay finally the name so spe okay spe dot plot Close open parenthesis. So the origin position. All joint variables are zero. Comma. Workspace. Okay, comma. Then. So your parenthesis the size of our. Uh, the size of our workspace okay so let's just uh, copy the workspace of our articulated manipulator so it's just 0 10 at the z axis so this is negative 10 then 10 then negative 10 then 10 then 0 and 10 okay then last part is that pitch okay so let's make sure that we don't have a value already of h01 up to h23. So let's clear all. And sorry, let's clear all. And CLC. Okay. So F5.
Okay, so this is our spherical manipulator. So it doesn't look uh, doesn't look good. Okay, so let's uh, drag the first joint. Okay, the second joint. Okay. Oh, the the third link. This is the third link. It's very long. Okay. So let's uh, try. Okay, it's translating. It's just two. It's just very long. <laughs> oh, it's very long. We may uh, cut some parts. Okay, let's make this three. Ah, oh, sorry, it's wrong. It is a wrong manipulator. Let's close this other manipulators here. Okay, so let's make this 5. So 3 plus 2, 5. 5, 5. Right. This will be fine. Hmm. Okay, 5, 3. So this is the... Okay, let's make 8, 2, 2. So this is just for uh, design. Okay, the mechanical design. Okay, so CLC. You may test, you may uh, already test here the mechanical design. If how long the links. Okay, so let's see. Oh, it's still very long. <laughs> oh, it's really long. Okay. But this is a spherical manipulator. This is a spherical manipulator. The link tree is just very long. Okay, let's make it. Let's make this one. This is three. Or make it two. Okay, let's make D three two. Two meters. Let's see what will happen. A F five. Okay, let's see if it's still very long. Okay. Oh, it's still very long. Oh, but oh, it's, it's fine. All right. Let's make uh, let's make it zero. Let's put it at the origin position. And see, and see if our mechanical manipulator is correct. Okay. So, z-axis should uh, point to the right direction. Y should point forward and X should point upward at the end effector frame. So, this is correct. At the base, X is positive at the right. Uh, y is positive at backward. And Z is uh, positive upward. Okay. So, this is correct. So, this is our uh, code for... Spherical manipulator, if you want to design it that is installed on a ceiling, make the A sub 1 negative. Okay? Make A sub 1 negative to make it uh, look like uh, upside down because A sub 1 is the first uh, link okay, from the base. So, let's see if... Oh, you will not see it because the, Z, the size of the z-axis is zero. Okay. So let's make this 10. Negative 10. Okay. So F5. Okay. So this is the spherical manipulator on ceiling. So don't mind the black line down, downward. Okay. It's... Uh, so this is the spherical manipulator if it is on the ceiling. Okay, don't mind that uh, black. That this this black one. Okay, this black uh, black line. Okay. 
So this is the code for spherical manipulator.